This is an RV. I'm sure you've seen motorhomes before, but have you ever seen one used as a base in DayZ? Well, today that's exactly what I'm gonna try to do. If you step inside, you'll see that this is a mobile base. On the front, you have a driver's seat, and behind that, you have seats for all of your teammates, and across is also a kitchen. After the seating and kitchen areas, you'll find a nice bathroom, and if you keep heading further back, you'll even find your very own bedroom, which is great for resting after a long day on the road. Now, this vehicle in particular is very expensive, so it's not going to be easy to get, and there are many downsides to living in it, as you're going to see. So, with all of this being said, let's head back to where it all started, as a fresh spawn on the coast. Alright guys, we are back at it on day Z. And today we are going to be playing on Escape from Trenaris. And I'm going to be playing with my friend Chopper, who's already on the server. I think he already has gear. So I'm just going to go try to get some gear and head over and uh, meet up with him. I don't really know what we're going to do today, but hopefully we can get something good going. Maybe make a cool base. I don't know. We'll see. But anyway, where did I spawn? I'm near Beloda. Extract is at uh, Prison Island. So I could go to safe zone from there. I knew today was going to be the start of a wonderful adventure because the first house I checked had a Tetris in it. That was really lucky and this thing was worth quite a bit of money. So I took that and then I went towards the police station to look for some guns. Oh, somebody's murdered here. Oh no. Oh, there's a crate. Okay, so there's a key that goes to this police station, it seems. And we get a Glock too, not bad. Alright, guess we're going to head over to Prison Island now. After a short swim, I got to the island and it was pretty quiet. I got a nice jacket, a killa helmet, and a few other things from the military barracks, and then I snuck my way into the prison itself where there wasn't much other than a few zombies. Not too bad of a little start. Got a killa helmet, got a really good armor, a Tetris. Like, this is actually a crazy run I just did. I just gotta sell now and meet up with Chopper. Chopper should be somewhere over here. Maybe you take a walk out back. What's out back? Is this your car? Oh. Dude got the whole base in his car. <laughs> dude, this is dude, I'm living on my car, bro. This is all I got. Chopper's base had just gotten raided, which is why he packed as much stuff in his car and got out of there. I made the joke that he was living out of his car, but then I thought about it for a second. Maybe this didn't have to be a joke. What if they sold a vehicle at the trader that would allow you to live in it? Oh, there's a motorhome. There's a motorhome. That's a house, man. That is a house. Wow, the price though. Yikes. Yeah, yeah, that's a lot of money to make. We can make that though. It's not that hard. So to our surprise, there was a motorhome that we could buy. This gave us something to work with and it looked like our idea might be possible. Although we did plan on living in the RV, we still needed some type of place to garage it because if we logged out, anybody could just break into it and take everything we owned. So our next goal was to drive up the coastline and see if we could find any decent sized garages that we would be able to park it in. Wait, do you think we could fit the RV, though, through this? I feel like it's too... Yeah, that's what I'm worried about. It's too small. It's got to be... We'd have to do, like, a big industrial building, then. Yeah, like the big two-door ones. There's ones up the coast we could hit. Thing is, there's absolutely no extracts, like, unless you rent a steroid. Or yeah, the that's the only issue. Maybe this isn't the spot. Yeah, yeah, we need to have an extract just in case. On our way north, we found a lot of potential spots to set up at, but none of them were perfect. We wanted a spot that was going to be close to an extract and be large enough to fit the RV in, so we kept on driving into the nighttime. Eventually, our path took us towards the town of Nova, which was known for its large industrial locations. Surely we would find the right type of building to set up in here. Oh. A surprise as well, okay. I think it's a shitty gun, though. I don't know. I think it was a pistol or something, like low caliber. We're putting him down or are we driving? We can get out if you want. Yeah, he shot from down here. Oh, there's a raided base in one of these buildings. Really? Oh, I see him. I see him. He's geared. He's dead. Nice. That dude actually has like decent stuff, it looks like. I don't know if it's solo or not. Alright, let me check this guy. He's right here. What does he have? A Val? Oh shit, that's good. He could be rich. He's got what, tier 4 armor? Nah, he just has a Val kit. Uh, tier 4 armor, yeah. It's like the Val, I guess. Oh. This is perfect. Yeah, this is. 
I didn't even know this building exists. Like, this is what? huge, dude. It's fucking massive. I don't even think I've like I go in here ever. Oh, I've never been in here. All we'd have to do is block these windows off, but like nobody could really get to these anyway because you like you can't boost. Maybe up there. They can shoot through there, but we can easily block that. It's not a problem. Maybe we can uh, make money from, uh, from one of your business empires, huh? Time to start the car dealership in here. A geared guy in front of me. I had him once. Oh, you drew, you dropped him. That's got to be the same guy who respawned. Nah, he had a he had a bag on like, and he's got like a he's got an SVD. Surprise. Told you they're never like... solo, man. I knew they're never solo. Yeah. You can't find a solos in Daisy anymore. Question is, is there another one? There is another one. There's two more on the hill. Two more on the hill. You good? I'm good. I'm good. I'm trying to take shots at them. They're running down. Are they actually? Yeah, one's running down on me. I don't know what the other one is. I'm running back. I'm hurt. I'm yep. getting pushed. That's him. I gotta run back to you because. Yeah, just go, just go, just go heal. Oh, I see him, I see him, man. Yeah. Oh, he hit me again. Got one. At least one more, watch out. Well, two. Good shit, my boy. I saved my life, bro. I was getting pelted from every corner. Remember when I said there's gotta be another one? Yeah, you ain't wrong, the whole army. Dude called the whole fucking tribe over. Oh my god, this guy looks kitted. We were missing a fucking code lock and we just got one off this guy. Nice. Nice, dude. At first, this looked like the ideal spot to set up a base, but after fighting that group, we realized that maybe we should settle somewhere else because their base was actually the next building over, meaning that we wouldn't even be able to build here if we wanted to. But it was fine because we had a few more gear sets now and we still had our car, which meant that we could drive anywhere else on the map and keep searching. Hmm. Nothing big enough. Well, we could probably fit it in there, but I don't like this spot that much anyway. Yeah. It's not the best spot. I like that building we were in. That was yeah, I love that building. Yeah. Open her up. Oh, shit. Don't oh, go in there. <laughs> go, 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 go. <laughs> this is going to come out and swing us. I feel like we can get in there so easy, though. Yeah, agreed. This large industrial building would have been the perfect spot for what we were trying to do, but someone beat us to it. However, we were able to identify some flaws in their building plan, which we were quite positive we could exploit later on. But for now, we just carried on further west. Wow, oh, what's a good spot? Isn't there like a castle you can pull in? Bro, that yes. Be yes. Isn't it right up here? Yeah, it's to the left here. It's like, it's like ruins, but like, it's like a massive open, like mm -hmm. rectangle. We could yeah, do something yeah, yeah. with that. We could cook with that. Oh yeah, we could. Let me see if it's taken. Oh, there it is taken. <laughs> oh my god. There's a mega god. compound up there, bro. Oh, they're active. There's a base here. Yeah. But yeah, there's a shop down tree. What the hell is this? RV or something? Or a big tank? Like a tank or something, yeah. Yeah, wow. it's a tank. Are they like raided or? Nah, they're building something here. It's like a latch up top. However these guys were, it looked like they were planning on building something massive here. Their main base was fully sealed, and although we didn't know how many doors they had, we knew that they most likely were only going to have tier 1, which was easy to raid. All of this combined with the fact that they had an armored vehicle outside made them a pretty appealing target. Once we set up our base, we would definitely be coming back here to give it a better scout. This right here could work, actually. You can fit the RV in here, I think. Easy. Yeah, yeah you can. If not, we can go to the right. But are we going to have enough nails to seal this compound? Not now, but we will, yeah. Yeah, we gotta run it up. Oh, that's nice, bro. That's real nice. <laughs> I love that. Yeah, you like that? Wow, that's beautiful, man. Where is that on the earth? I wanna go there. I think that's London. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say Birmingham. <laughs> Birmingham? <laughs> <laughs> that's what they call cozy right there. I'm straight. With the base now set up and a decent amount of gear stashed away, we now turned our focus to making money as fast as possible, and we thought the best way to do this would be running the Tizzy Labs location. 
This spot is known for having some of the best gear on the server, and usually you need a keycard to enter, but lucky for us, Chopper still had some keycards left over from his previous adventure. It's open. Oh, what the hell? Green's open. Oh, are they all in here? Yeah. Okay. Uh, blue is here. It's not done. Black is done. Wanna hit him? Yeah, yeah I hope there's not a siren. <laughs> Oh no. Yeah, alright. Show me the loot. Oh! Oh! That's good. Put the C4 in your case, bro. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh! Wait, that's so big. So good. That's so good. With our bags full, we ran back out to the car to store our C4, and then we made our way back into the Tizzy military base to carry on the looting. Dead. I think it's just one. Yeah, I'm thinking so. Oh, uh, Gilly pushing me. From HQ, HQ, HQ. Far? Uh, No, no, close. Like, he's behind the HQ. He's behind the HQ, like close. Damn, I see him. You going nuts, all shit. Dad, dad. Oh no, he's hit. He's not dead. I thought he was dead. Where did he go? I don't know. Uh, he's in this bushes somewhere. Like, oh, same, same, he's same. in front of me. He's close. He's close. Yeah, 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 yeah. Chill. Sure. He's down. Oh, one more, one more. Dead, 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 dead. Good kills, my boy. Make sure this guy is full dead. Yeah. Good point. Yeah, he's 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 fucking dead, dead. <laughs> this guy, this guy looking like he has a little bit of a little bit of stuff on. Yeah, these guys are. <laughs> yes, right. And this is where I get headshot by his seventh teammate. Oh my god, dude, he has an SA58 with a drum. Wow. Right after this fight, the server restarted, which meant all of the locked crates inside of the lab location had respawned. Since we were already in this area, we ran back to use the rest of our keys with the hopes that we would be able to find some more C4. Wow. Oh my god. Oh, Ledex. Oh, wow. Oh, case, case, camera case, bro. Camera case. Oh. Ledex as well, bro. Pick the C4 in yet. Camera case. Yeah, yeah. Oh, we have so much shit to move in, man. I'll just move the code lock C4. Our tizzy run ended in a success, and we put everything back in our base. And afterwards, we went out to look for some nails. Pickle, 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 pickle. Fucking like Humvee or something. On the road. On the road. You can kill him. I can't see. I can't see. Oh, he's turning around. He's going back towards you. I hit him. I think. I don't know. Yeah, he's going to go on the road. He's going to go on the main road. Oh, no. He's pulled into this car. Uh, this lot. He's going up this road right now. He's trying to run me over. Watch out, watch out. Get off the road. Careful. Yeah. He's like right on me right now. I don't think we can shoot through this though. He's dead. He's dead. Inside. I killed him. Wait, what? He was on con. Bro, his door is wide open. I know I opened it. Oh my god, I thought you were gonna shoot him when you opened it. I did. I thought he was dead. He was on con. I thought he was dead. I think he went right, right? I think he went right, yeah, but this is probably gone now. I think I hear it. Oh, he's right on this corner. Where is he? He's going to the tower. That thing is armored bad, dude. Like, you cannot penetrate that. Oh, he stopped. He stopped. You can kill him, you can kill him. His boy got him in. Oh, no way. No way, dude. We almost had it. That is unbelievable. Yeah, you killed his teammate and I walked by and the dude's still alive. <laughs> well, he was on con for me, bro. Like, and I thought he was dead. Like, 
I hit him with 3 3. I thought he was dead. We could have had it all. <laughs> Actually, man, that's me right now. Oh, Bitcoin. Yay. Oh, 85 bands. Should we go for that or? Yeah. It's like right here. <laughs> Is that at you? Yeah, there's you, do you, is you. He's up in the woods. Yeah, I heard the snaps. I just figured he's maybe shooting somebody else. There's a guy on the hill, uh, this way. He's aiming. He's aiming at somebody. I'm not gonna shoot. I don't know if we should shoot that. Oh, he's gonna be on the rocks right here. Yeah. Do we put him down? I can nail him if he's on the rocks, yeah. We got one guy. On the other side, too, somewhere. Maybe we push this guy, honestly. The rap guy? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, let's go. Let's just take him out. Because he's going to be checking those shots. I'm, I'm positive. Like, I see a dead gully uh, by that bridge over there. Northwest. You have a drone. Oh, I'm running on the, on the train. On the train. Oh, yeah, yeah. See, 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 see. Dead. Nice, good shots. I don't think that's the guy though, is it? Uh, it might have been, I don't know. Really don't know. Wait, is this an extract? Yeah, yeah. Oh. Poor guy was extracting. Rip their own ease, man. Oh, behind us, what's up? Somewhere up the hill. There's a guy in the city too, I just saw. Yeah, yeah. I'm just gonna heal. He might push down. The guy on the train track, he just tanked the 338. Like, it went through him. Oh no. He's geared. He's uh, he's close at the train track at that, uh, like, little, I don't know, that tower, the telephone wires or whatever. Oh, yeah, yeah. I see a guy. Oh, I just got fucking hit. Hard. Where is he? Uh, down the road by the uh, bridge. We're literally surrounded in four fucking sides right now. I know, I think we pushed sides into the hill. Where is this idiot? Pushing up the hill? Yeah. Go, go, go. Yeah, one's pushing, one's pushing right now. Where? Uh, from like downhill. Yes, 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 yes. I lost visual. Dead. Good shots, man. I think that's the guy I saw back. No, actually, it's not, it's not, it's not. This guy didn't have an ult and I see him. Where is he? He hit me hard. Uh, down the road, like right at the bridge. But he's at that, that uh, fence. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have to heal. He, he didn't die. He got some good armor. You hit him? I mean, I think I hit him, but I don't, I don't, I don't know. He tanked it if I did. He's running. He's running. Uh oh! Watch out! Oh, on me. Bad, I think. Maybe. No, he's, he's not, he's not, he's, he's running, running, he's running. I'm chasing. Dead. Now he's dead. Watch out, that guy came back up, by the way, the, the geared guy. Yeah, I'm like 35 HP. One's close. I see him. I'm running back to you. I can kill him, I think, if he stops. I have to heal. This guy's close, it's too close. He's killed one, killed one, full geared, raid bag. Nice, buddy, nice. I'm falling back so I can just heal up. Yeah, go heal, I'm still good, I'll try to cover you. This is fucking, what's that movie when they're walking through Afghanistan getting hunted down? <laughs> yeah! Lone survivor, bro. No, lone survivor, bro. They just keep coming. I see one, on the road. Uh, like at the train station, actually. Train, train station. Okay. Same guy that we've been trying to fight. Yeah, behind you. 
Maybe in, I think he's in the shed. I think he's in the shed. I think I swear I saw like a gun like protruder. Uh, which shed? The one on the right or the it's one? Close run. Yeah, it's close one right. Oh, he's inside. I'm dead. I just got fucking melted. Yeah, he's good ammo. I killed him. Nice, buddy. Hit M4. For a brief moment, things seemed to quiet down and I repositioned to watch Chopper's body because he had our car key on him. If we lost that body to any grubs or even other geared players, we would lose our only car. I want to get your key. Nah, no, no, no. Don't risk our money to Kawa. I'm going to pull back to a range where I can just watch your body. I don't care about anybody else right now. That did respawn, pretty sure. Yeah, you got shredded, but I think he hit you with a full, like he ripped you with the M4, bro. He probably had good ammo too. Yeah, this guy came from base. They all just run back from base, like. Yeah, this guy just literally had an ops core helmet and like a PVP kit phlegm is his name. All right, bro, don't get sniped. No one shot me, so I think we're okay. Did you die? Yeah, I died. He's way up across. I see him. I could key that though. I can probably kill him. Uh, yeah, but then his boys might go fucking loot it, so just be careful. Oh, I see one behind me. <laughs> what? It's the same people. They keep running back, dude. I'm telling you. Like, I'm fighting the same, same like, four people ten times in a row. No, I agree. I agree. I'm trying to get us falling back now. I think I, I see your body. I think you're fine, man. I think your shit's still there, yeah. Yeah, I think so, yeah. Oh, someone's shooting. What? He's right next to me. Oh, he's shooting the guy down there. Wait, wait. He just killed the guy down there. Oh, really? Yeah, 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 yeah. This is the guy who killed you. I'm going to push him right now. He's right in front of me. Can I aim my gun, God forbid? Thank you. <laughs> Holy. <laughs> Maybe I killed him? I don't know. <laughs> Dead. <laughs> nice. This is him, yeah, he had a suppressed SVD. Oh, one, one, one guy, one guy here on me. Uh, come between me and you on the train station. He's prone right now. At the at the train station? Le no, on the train tracks. Like, come towards me and you're gonna see him. Like, I will literally go right behind him now. Yeah, one sec, one sec, I'm coming. I gotta run. Oh, you proned here. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming, I'm coming. I'm, I'm, I'm almost near you. Ah, uh, you can kill him. My gun jammed. No! I hit him. Dead, 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 dead. He's dead, he's dead. Go, come quick, come quick. I'm, I'm, bro, I'm 40 HP. There you go, go, go. Oh, another one. I'm, I'm dead. I'm full dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I like, like, I picked up his gun, but I had no ammo in it. After what felt like an hour long fight, I was finally taken down. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, it was really annoying because I was pretty positive the only reason I died right there was because my well-worn gun jammed on me, which is like the dumbest concept I've ever seen. But anyway, we lost a bunch of gear. The forest floor was littered with bodies that had decent stuff, and we also lost our car keys, meaning that we no longer had a BMW. I tried to grab a gear set and run back to see if I could salvage the situation and make a play, but it looked like there were people waiting outside of our base. There's a dead guy right there. What's going on? Is there a sniper I'm, not, I'm unaware of? What did, what did I miss here? 
Oh, there is a sniper. What the flip? Oh well, anyway. I'm back at base, I guess. Where are they? Where's, where are we at? <laughs> They're literally right here. They're at this house. I could go probably kill them. But do I want to take out another gear set? Hmm. We see it from our base? No, but I mean, it's literally like a 30 second run. We'll see them. I don't know if we want to fight them or if I should just log. We don't have to, but they're like right there. Yeah, we can fight them. So the, so the house next to me is where he was, right? Like the, the, like the yellow one with the red roof. Okay. It's the last house on the road leaving our like village or city. Yeah. One was in there and then one was up towards these two barns where I am. Like he shot me from up on the hill here. And there's a body in the main road. I see the body on the road. It's been... Is that loaded? I think this guy's still inside. He was in that house when he I is. saw him. Yeah, he comes, 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 comes. He's in here. Good kill. There's at least one more. He had an SVU. This is, yeah, this is what he killed me with. Oh, watch out, watch out. He's shooting. Is he? Yeah, yeah, he is, he is, he is. Get in, get in. Where? Where, where, where? I don't know. I suppressed. I have no clue. I got his bag. I'm dropping it off in here. Don't know what's in there. Yeah. Oh, bar hella barter shit. Oh, nice. Yeah, that's good. Wow. Dude is kidded. They're going to see us take it to base. That's my concern right now. <laughs> yeah, it is. Then they're offlining. One of these guys was a sniper and he must have watched us pick up his buddy's gear and run back home. But I tried to loop up into the hills so that he wouldn't track us back to base. Once home, I stored everything and I took one final look at all of the stuff we had gotten in the past day. And honestly, the base was looking pretty good considering the amount of time we had spent. It was now time to log off for the night, but I hoped that when I logged back in tomorrow, all of this stuff would still be here. They're actually offline. That's crazy. <laughs> oh, right. so, I log in. Yeah, nothing here. Like a little bit of rubble here. That's it. All right. I'm looking at this white mask on the ground like ah, another day, another raid. <laughs> you know, I'm good now. I can just rebuild. So I went around, found enough for a code log, went to safe zone, got enough. Came back. The flag's gone. And more shit's taken. I'm like, ah, okay. They have to live close. So I built a door. This, this little one by one door here. <laughs> My first tiger was going over in that direction to the, uh, <laughs> that, that beige and a little castle over there. Oh, yeah. I hear footsteps. Hmm. A little, uh, a little suspicious. Metal doors. Hmm. Even more suspicious. All I hear in the background. Ooh. Fucking Strider rolls up behind <laughs> me, man. Packs up. Fucking got the ball, bro. Take it all. Back no bullshit. No way. Yeah, literally C4 sledges, everything. But I'm like, I'm, I'm out. I'm out. I got, the, I got the fucking Strider out front now. The Oshkosh. No way, bro. Yeah, come, come, come take a peep, man. To summarize what happened, we got offline raided that morning and Chopper logged in to find pretty much nothing in the base. So he went to the trader to rebuild, but once he got back with the stuff needed to build, he noticed that people had taken even more stuff from the base, meaning that whoever raided us probably lived nearby and they were doing trips back and forth. Naturally, Chopper went around the area to investigate and he started by checking out the house that we saw the day before. These guys were our closest neighbors from what we knew and they had some decent stuff. Once he got over there, he was able to ambush them and take their armored car along with a whole bunch of supplies. And now we were going to run back to see what they were doing. How does this shit all happen? Like, when did these dudes operate? Like 3 a.m.? Like 5 a.m.? Like It looked like when they came back with the Oshkosh when I killed them, like they just got from back from a raid because they had a bunch of storage in there, like random bits. Also, oh, they did it like this morning, basically, or I guess. Yeah, I think they did our raid and then somebody else. Careful, they could be at their castle, though. Remember they were building that? Nah. Yeah, but I heard them inside here and then. I can cover door then if you want to. Yeah, yeah, cover door on Ella. Uh... You do that. One dead. Both dead, both dead. Doors open. Oh my god. No way. They're gonna respawn though. Oh, he's opening. Alright, these guys are gonna fuck up, by the way. Hard right now. Yeah, if they're down. They just get ready. He, he opened and saw me. He saw me. He like flicked it open and closed it. <laughs> oh, that's unfortunate.
killed one. But he's not geared, not geared. He came from outside. Oh, I hear him. Unless that's you. No, that's him. He just opened and saw me, bro. He just saw me. He flicks it open. No. You can't shoot. You literally can't shoot, dude. These are playing with fire. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'll pretend like I'm running away. Okay, go, go. Killed him, killed him. I'm one more deep. I'm one more deep. I'm coming in. But I don't know how many more he has. Oh my god. Mm, yeah. Oh, gear, gear here. Come here, come here. He's all gear. I will just start a ticket right now. The admin can see if anybody logged out in the base, their coordinates, and GG, you're banned. They don't fucking play around on this server, buddy. Hey, man, you still there? I wish I had like the soundboard to play C4 sound, bro. He would shit his pants right now. Yeah, he would. Yeah, he would. Z zombie aggro, zombie aggro tied. Oh, yeah, since he closed it. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I can slide it. I'm deep. I'm one more deep. No way. I'm one more deep. I swear to God. Okay, well, I'll just come back and fucking Come blow. back, come back now. Go, 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 go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Before his boy, his boy's gonna come back. He's gonna respawn in. You gotta watch upstairs. I'm watching, like, I'm watching the... it. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming, I'm coming. This is dead frequency. Oh, he's back. Yeah, he's upstairs. Yeah, he's falling back in. That's fine, though. That's good, that's good. Wait, his friend just ran in, but didn't close the door. He, like, loaded in or something. So, somebody was asking for uh, <clears throat> a healthy supply of C4, huh? So, uh, I would be that guy. And I would deliver. Don't worry. Yeah, don't you go be logging out. I hear you's up there. No? But you ain't those guys. Yeah. What happened to being solo? You're not that guy. You're just the average hey, player. But you're yep, nobody special. Me. <laughs> what is that's going me, on? Average player. Yeah. At least you know where your place is in this world, buddy. Yeah, I do. And I, I hope you know your place. It ain't in this fucking home. Because I'm coming in. Let me know when you're ready. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on, wait. Okay, I'm gonna do it now, go. No way, he combat logs. He logged. Wait, did he kill himself? Did he kill himself? Is this him? I'll check. Check, check a body. Out. Surely he didn't combat log, right? Oh my God, look at this, look at this box. Keys and shit for days. Oh yeah. This guy's name is Dead Frequency. Maybe it is him. Hmm. Yeah, it is, it is. What the fuck, did he just... F11 with a knife or something? This base was pretty loaded. We made out with a few hundred thousand in cash, a bunch of other valuable resources like code locks, nails, armors, guns, and most importantly, we got enough concrete to last us for months if we wanted. The craziest part was that we would have never had enough C4 to fully raid this base, but they just kept opening doors for some strange reason, and well, we ended up getting everything. <laughs> do you think it's them who raided, bro? Because they do have five things down here. Yeah, I'm 99% sure it is. They offline, they come back here, they have the same five uh, gear stands we had in our base. Yeah, I'm, I'm almost 100% sure. Yeah. We were pretty positive these were the guys that raided us, but in the end, we couldn't really prove for certain. Anyways, we took their armored car and drove that back to base, and we also took their right SUV, meaning that we had three different cars now. Alright guys, we cleaned up the base, it was a little bit messy. We sorted everything out. Everything's well organized now. We have a lot of gear. Like, we have a lot. Even though we got offline, we made 10 times more back with that raid today. We still have three C4. We have a bunch of grenades. Look at all the keys and money we have. We're going to be able to make a lot off these keys. We finally had enough money to buy the RV that we had planned on getting this whole time. But before we did that, we had to block off the courtyard to make it into a garage that we would be able to park the RV in. After all, this was the whole point of building at this location. Once this was done, we made our way back to the trader, sold our other armored vehicle, and traded it in for the RV. Let's take a look inside. Oh, look at this. There's a bed back here. Dude, look at the storage, though. It says attach. What does that do? Oh, you can put your gun up. Oh, look at that. Yeah. 
Dude, we got a bathroom? We're gonna live in this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 100%. Let's get away. Let's get away and then we'll discuss it. Yeah, let's get out of here. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm dead. Oh. <laughs> drive, drive, drive. Only a few minutes into our first run with the RV and I was already sniped out of it. But you know what? I wasn't gonna let this demotivate me from using this thing as our base. I grabbed some new gear and we went back out to hunt down the guys that shot me. Here, I'm opening. Go on ahead, pull her in, buddy. One guy's, one guy's running towards the base now. That's fine, just get in. No. That doesn't fit. Uh, what if I close the door? He's just gonna shoot me. Close the door. You see right. <laughs> so they're down in town, where are they? They were literally at the um, construction. Okay. I see a guy north of town. Oh, behind me. Coming. He's uh, behind train station now. Train yeah, yeah, I'm pushing. Train tracks, I don't know where he went. Is her bad in train station right now? Pushing him. He's uncon, uncon. Oh, nice, nice. This guy's like north side. Get him, a bunch. Dead. Good shit. I think there's one more inside. Could be upstairs. Yeah. He's just sitting there. Okay. I'm dead. He traded him, or he unconned him. He's dead. After taking care of the guys that shot our RV, we went back home and fixed the garage, allowing us to actually pull it inside of the parking area. Now that this was set, we added a few more layers to our base to make it a little bit harder to raid. And then we were gonna set out on an adventure with the RV to hit all of the keys we had around the map. All right, boys, another pretty good day. We uh, sold one of our other cars, but we finally got the RV, which is the whole point of, I guess, our adventure. We're gonna try to live out of the RV, but we have a nice little base to store the cars. Uh, this is the perfect spot. There's a lot of action around here, and like, you know, if we have to repair the RV, refuel it, do anything, we can pull it into that bay we built, and we'll be good. We also added another door here, so that's pretty good. And down the halls are blocked, so they basically have to come up here unless they jump through a window. But jumping through the windows is quite hard to do. And yeah, you can see we're, we're doing alright after that raid. Honestly, those guys had a lot of gear. We are looking very good right now. Um, inside the loot room, got rows. <laughs> of gear 338s up there in here we got like a bunch of grenades keys cash all of that in like two days it's not too bad we're doing all right uh yeah you maybe want to check inside first oh yeah let's see what you got i forgot <laughs> <laughs> damn are you comfy you cozy i'm cozy ah uh, what do we got here let's take a look for our it's it, this is the maiden voyage really it is Ah, uh, fun BC, we get spare armor, grenades. Damn, bro, we were, we're prepared for war in here. Did you put up guns? Is there spare guns? Oh, yeah. Of course, look in the weapon case. Damn, so even if we die? We will right back up to it. You know what? Maybe I go take a little nap in that back. <laughs> Let's see how practical it is, though. Our plan was to drive the RV down the main highways all the way around the map in a big circle. We had a bunch of keys to hit, including over at the oil rig and down south, so this was the perfect chance to do that. With this portable base setup, we had every single thing we would need for any situation we would encounter, including if we died. Oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah. All right, Chief, time to suit up. It sure is. I'll change in the bathroom. Time to do some swimming, man. Oh, oh, it's money. Not too bad. Oh, it's money. After running oil, we made our way back to the RV and drove down the coast towards Electro, where we had some keys to the school there. Oh. Not bad. Okay. We can work with that. After getting some more rifles and nails out of the final box, we got back in the RV and we made our way south towards the prison island where we parked it on the beach and opened up one of the crates there. This box had a lot more guns and we took as many as we could and packed them into the RV and carried on on our journey. We had been driving around in this thing for over half an hour and we hadn't gotten shot at yet or really even seen anything, but this was all about to change when we got towards our next destination in Zelenogorsk.
There's a guy down at Zelen. Pretty geared. Oh, really? Yeah, he's on the main road. He's running out now. He's running, like, uh, towards Green Mountain, I guess. Oh. Is he far? Should... No, he's at this double brown or whatever. Like, he just left the Zelen military base and cut right. So, like, we're going to see him in the ravine, maybe, or, or somewhere up ahead. Oh, there. There he is. Oh, he's in here, he's in here, he's in here. I heard him. I hit him. He's on God. Dead. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's on God. John, time up. Don't move, don't move, buddy. Freeze, Otherwise, Buster. you die. Alright, 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 alright. I'm not gonna move. Yeah, don't. Yeah. Put your hands above the head. I'm not gonna move. Uh, how do you do that? F5. I'm not. Yeah, it looks like we got a live one, huh? What do we do with that? Yo. Don't kill me, man, please. I'm, I just got back to the game. Alright, bro. Drop your gear. We'll see what you have. We'll let you be, alright? Uh, I need to lower my gun, my yeah, hands to fine. drop my gear. Hey. I think he's outside, actually. You hear that? Yes. Yeah, ready? What? Oh. What, was that? what were you trying to do, pal? That you could outsmart me. Was, was that guy with you? I don't know. Does he look like us? What Does he look like he's with me? What the fuck is this? Yeah, I mean, he's dressed up like you guys, so I thought he was with you. What the fuck was that? How come he sneaks in, yes. shoots my buddy, doesn't shoot at you? Hmm. Hmm. Let me see what you have. Huh? Have questions, huh? You got some decent stuff, actually. What? We're going to take what we need. And you're going to be on your way. Yeah, if you, All right. if you do whatever you want, dude. I mean, you can do, you can take whatever you want. Don't, don't pick up a gun and spray us, man. All right? No, I'm not gonna do that, dude. Trust me, I'm not gonna do that. Give us like 20 seconds at least after we leave, then get your gear. Okay, okay, I, I won't move for like 20 seconds, 30 seconds. Yeah, scream out loud. Count zero to 100. Alright. Stop. One, two, three, four, five. He's gonna shoot us, bro, I'm telling you. <laughs> That's a big gun. He's across. A oh, left. Yeah. yeah. Huh? He's that way. The way you're looking, he's that way. It's a different guy. Oh, I'm hit. Ah, uh, some. Okay, I lost a little bit of 65. health. Sixty-five. Yeah, it could be worse. Could be worse. I'm knocked. Not all. Oh, that's him. I hit him. I hit him again. I'm just taking regen. Careful, bro. Don't get headshot. I think I killed him. Okay. I don't know. That dude was f***ing beaming me. Hats have been a 338, I think. Oh, somebody lured him. Really? Somebody lured oh, him. Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, there's another one then. Gotta be on alert now. It's in the dorms. Yeah, let's go check. There's still roof access, I believe. Yeah, yeah there is. There is. I think he must be in the yellow dorm, honestly. Yellow door. Uh, this gear on the this gear here on the ground is like a suppressed gun. Oh, I'm in. You did full dead? No, I'm con. Yep, he was up here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tagila mask, level six armor. Oh, yes. Somehow we survived our fighting at Zelen, and our next destination was back up north at Tizzy, where we could run the labs cards once again to try to get some C4 and do some big raids to end this adventure. I see one. White bag right in front of us. Across the road. Going leftish. Oh, yeah, I seen. There's two of them, two of them. Yeah. Bombs down the ridge. Uh, oh, he's across the river, running I away. I see him, I see him, yeah. Oh, he went into tree. He's down. No, he's not, he's not, he's not. He just ate two, three, three, eights. Down. See the other one, uh, to the right. What? Uh, like where I'm aiming, I, I don't know what to call that. Like twelve, uh, like one o'clock. He went down this ridge, like right where I'm looking. Okay. He's about to do it now. I see him doing it. Wait, he's aiming down there. He opened it. He he's just about to open it. No, he didn't open the key room yet. He's doing it. Yeah, he is. We gotta go now. Go 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 go. Get ready. Cause we gotta yeah, catch yeah, him let's, opening. Let's go. Yeah yeah exactly exactly. He's coming back. Follow you. Oh, no, he didn't see me. He didn't see me. 
I think he's gonna open. Wait, wait, he went left. There's two. Two, 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 two. Okay, already, already, they're coming. Okay. This is all you for the first guy. He's hurt. Not dead, not dead. Yeah. Oh, nade, 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 nade. He need throw nade. Run, 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 run. Yeah, yeah. He's down the end. He's just sitting down the end. Hit him once. He's far side, far side. Next, next corner. I'm going right here. He's right here. Next, next corner. No, no, no. I'm with you. I'm with you. You can swing him. You can swing him. Nice. Good shit, good shit, bro. Good fighting. Please tell me they have a key. I mean, I feel like he would have opened it already because he was down here. Yeah, I think they were just checking it out or something. These guys didn't have anything crazy, but we took what we could and then used the rest of our tizzy keys to unlock some crates under the HQ building. We got pretty lucky with these crates and found two extra breaching charges in them. If we paired these with the explosives we left in the RV base, we would be able to do some decent raids. So we got back on the road and went to look for some targets to hit. All right, so where's right. base target number one? Uh, I guess we go over, all right? Yeah, that should be a quick in and out. I mean, I don't think he has more than one garage door in there. Nah, I don't think so either, yeah. Oh yeah, he only has one gate. You could see through the side, like the frame of it. <laughs> oh shit, Captain. We're loaded. Oh, hold on, hold on. It adds up, man. It adds up while he has one door. <laughs> yeah, it does. As you can tell, this base was a bit of a stinker, but it wasn't an issue because we still had some more C4 to go. Maybe we could find something a little bit bigger to hit this time. Oh, is this it, Rare? Yeah. We can see right in there, man. Like if they're online. Hey, <laughs> same idea, bro. <sighs> oh, wow. Yeah, that's a lot. Okay, over here is decent stuff. It's over here. Okay, that's, that's okay. Okay, not too bad, not too bad. Didn't cost us anything. <laughs> oh, you're right. Now, where do we go? Okay, we still have a decent amount of C4. You know what we could? Just try and raid, just see how deep we could go. Is the, um... Another base in Novo that we could boost over. In Novo, yeah. Yeah, you know that factory building that, like, uh, you said we could, like, pull the RV up and boost over? We could try. I think we definitely could boost it. Yeah, I think we get over this easy. Yeah, I think so. That's a, that's a big base at apartments. Yeah, I know, yeah. Like, they might actually see us encounter. Oh, no, 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 no. I f***ed it. Don't, don't jump there. Don't jump there. This is... Uh, I found an airlock. There you go. You're good. All right. Beautiful. Oh. Ain't no way, bro. We got to get out. We got to get out. <laughs> this is kind of hard. Nah, we can make it. But we need to make a play on these guys. 100% eventually. What the hell, dude? Did they not, like, see us or hear us? I guess not. Dude, the garage is open here. There's a garage door open here as well, like, a metal one. Yeah, dude, yeah, we gotta, we gotta boom in this. The problem is, there's gonna be doors here, though. Like, we don't know how many it how is. How many? I don't know, but, like... Max, like, two, three, four, right? It's gotta be a few. We have enough. We got sledges, so... Open sesame. Oh. Aww. Right. Another... That's fun. Where's the C4? What's that? I don't see it at all. Oh, lovely. I hear it. Is that, I, this one's blinking. What? Yeah, okay. Get away from this area then. What the f Is that bug? Yeah. Oh, okay. This should be the last one, I think, and then it's open. 
Okay, Cotton. Oh, yeah. All right, we're in. I'm getting the flag. Oh, what do we got? Let's check in here. You think that's the goodies, man? I think that might have to be the goodies. All right, let me see what else he has first. Then we'll dig in. This base was nothing crazy, but we got some decent stuff out of it, including a lot of much needed ammo. And they had an entire wall filled with the guns that we were able to take from. We definitely didn't profit off of this base, but if you remember, we heard a helicopter take off next door. And that meant they would eventually fly back home. And when they did, we were going to try to make a play on them since they were right up the road. Maybe we could profit there. Oh, it's coming back. Yeah. There's at least two of them inside. I swear on my life that landed on the ground. Yeah. I guess you could break out. That's probably a free heli, bro. I'm in the safe, pal. Uh, we got about 400 nails, Bitcoin, some 338 ammo, like three hex grid tier six armors, which is actually worth. Yeah. I'm going to actually take those. Uh, and that's about it. And I say 58. Oh, nice. Did this guy carry some shit back to base now? All right, I'm coming out then. One dead. Come on. Is the heli downstairs? Uh, it's got to be down somewhere. Oh. One guy in the hills as well. Oh, I see him upstairs. He, one's upstairs. Yeah, there's three of them. One's outside. I'm falling back slightly. I'm hit. Literally can't hear it. You're on the AT. Yeah, yeah, it's a weak gun, but it's literally silent, full automatic. I don't know where he is. Maybe at this close apartment. Yeah, it could be. He's up there. He's coming down, though. Dude, a lot of these doors aren't built. I see one guy in there. Dude, we could raid this, I think. Well, I got C4 on me right now. He's opening doors and shit in there. How many? I, I heard one at least. <laughs> They're gonna be spooked now, bro. I'm checking this. So there's a door, a door right here too. Yeah, this is the one I saw. Uh, oh, it's open! It's open! It's open! It does have a call lock. Yeah. One's in the side room, right side. He's starving. <laughs> One dead. Was he on the roof? Yeah. One's probably Good in that room. room. I got a sledgehammer here. Oh, big, big, Oh big. my god. Bro, bro. What? Come here. Just look at it. Just look there already. Oh, wow. Yeah, they're rich. Okay, this guy's this guy's here. This guy's here, by the way. Um, okay. what, what you need to do, run by uh, and open the door. Yeah, and then you finish him. Huh? And then I'll spray him. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, no, no. Just come by the corner. Pre-fire it. Oh, he's hurt. He's hurt. Dead. There's one yes. more at least. Yeah, he's upstairs. I think. Or is it me hungry? It might be me. Might be you. I'm gonna check this guy. I got a grenade. I do too. I can lob that bitch up there actually. I'm gonna lob it now. Go for it, man. Run back, run back, run back. You're going up? You're reckless. Oh, he's so bad. He's hit a few times. Uncon's dead. No way you win that, dude. I won that. No I way won you won fight. that. How? Ain't no way we pulled up on him like that. Ain't no way. There's no way you climb a ladder and he doesn't win that, dude. You're literally stationary. Well, we don't really need anything. That's the crazy part. So we could just leave if you want. Yeah. I already filled up on guns. Uh, there's still like 400 or so nails in the other base we could grab if you want, just to take. We'd give it away to people, I guess. How do you not see a fucking big ass motor motorhome RV, sticking yeah. out? <laughs> just sitting in your neighbor's base. Yeah. And just like that, we Romo off into the sunset in our RV. You know, our trusty RV, she, uh, she suited us nicely. 
She never let us down, and although I got shot out of it one time, it was pretty reliable for the most part. It drove fast, it had a lot of storage, we never really had to even go back to our base, honestly. We went back to just quickly grab some stuff to give away, but the rest of our time on the server was spent on the RV, although nothing crazy really happened, I'll be honest with you guys. We finally reached a point where there wasn't really much we could do. We had done everything we set out to accomplish, so we packed the RV with as much stuff as we could and went to the trader to sell a lot of it and to also give the rest away. Boys, RV uh, for $7.50. Yeah, what's up, man? RV750. We got like five seats in there, six seats. I don't seats have in there. a weapon. <laughs> did, I, did I have Nazar? Yeah, I'm right here, bro. That's Nazar. Yeah, That's Billy. Nazar? Yeah, man. Hey, Billy, this is my home. Right yeah. Oh my god. Let you know, bro, that game. I can take that. Right, right, right. There's a 338 coming. I can't There's grab a 338 coming. Get ready. It's gone. Oh my god, y'all fast. <laughs> East of Severgrad, there's a school. We're gonna we're gonna be the code. The code is. 532532. So 532532, six numbers. That's the code. It's fing loaded, boys. Good luck. Let's go, go, man. Let's go, go. Wow. <laughs> How much is this? Wait, where's our RV? I sold it. 750. All oh, right. That guy actually paid for it? Yeah. <laughs> And that concludes our RV adventure on Chinaris. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video if you made it to the end. And as always, I'll catch you in the next Daisy adventure. Thank you all, and have a good day.